Merry Christmas. I was doing a Bible study the other day on 3 John and came across this wonderful verse. I think it fits 2020 really well. John says, I had much to write to you, but I would rather not write with pen and ink. I hope to see you soon, and then we'll talk face to face. Peace be to you. In this year, I can think of no other bl blessing to give someone than peace. Peace in the midst of a pandemic, in the midst of job changes and challenges in all kinds of ways. But I want you to know, God is with us. That's what the incarnation is all about, his coming down to be with us. And that's something we as a family have come to understand in many great ways. As you know, I'm still hunting for the church um, that God has for us next. But in the midst of that, it's been amazing to see how God has provided for us. He's given us some amazing friends at Church of the Resurrection, and he's given me lots of discipleship projects to work on in the meantime. Anna as well is working on a, a teaching English as a foreign language class, and then hopefully her master's degree. Zach is at Gordon College and is thriving there. Caleb has started along with Gabby at Veritas Press's um, online school, and he's a junior and she's a freshman now this year. It's been a great year. God has been attentive in the midst of it all. Even though 2020 has been hard, God has been so good. There's a great line from C.S. Lewis that says, it's always winter, but never Christmas. But the great hope in that story, the Chronicles of Narnia, is that Christmas does come. Jesus is on his way. He is going to make all things right. Merry Christmas.
<laughs> There's a tap for my dog! Okay? Okay? You gotta make sure both can see it. I know that it can see it there. We could just hold it in front of that. <laughs> okay. And. Is there a clock back or leisure? 